pirouettes in his bedroom. And it's all thanks to you, Jack. All thanks to the fact that you couldn't stick to our simple arrangement and answer the fucking phone when I called. I couldn't pick up the phone because at the moment when you called, the phone was literally being shot at. And then hey, I... You're one lucky bastard, Jack. I mean, you, you are lucky that I have such a cold black heart, completely incapable of compassion, without batting an eyelid. I will leave that poor stutterer Chris with nothing. I'll make a couple of calls, and he'll turn right around on that road he's on to Sharpwood and return to his miserable life of the lonely loser. He's just not the right man for Tanya. I mean, some people just aren't made for each other, you know? <laughs> and true, you'll have to pay me twice as much. Twice? 20000 But I only oh, just... That, that's not the worst of it, Jack. You not only have to pay me twice as much, but you'll have to do it four times as often. 20000 a week. I hope whatever mess you got yourself in, you, you still got all your fingers, or, or at least enough of them to pull out a bank transfer. How long until the next payment? Huh? Four days? Uh, come on. Let's talk, oh, like... Oh, I'm sorry, Jack. I have another call. I, I'm guessing that Mr. Cervantes just finished eating his strawberries. His what? Strawberries? Listen, Fry, I'm just asking you... Fuck. Five forty four in progress. Five forty four complete. Five twenty two in progress. Forty-one in progress. Five twenty-two complete.
541 complete. Five fifty five in progress. Five fifty five complete. Five twenty six in progress. Five twenty six complete. Five eleven in progress. Five eleven complete.
Hello? Yeah, I'm listening. It's me. I I'm listening, Lily. I decided that I wanted to talk about... about the woman. What woman? About the woman with the coins. Lily, do you realize that you're calling me in the middle of the night? It was wrong, Jack, what you did. I'm not trying to exaggerate. It's not the worst thing you could... I, I don't want to compare it with... I want to tell you that I think it was wrong, and I think that you yourself understand that it was wrong. Am I wrong? Lily, go to sleep. Jack, I want to... just want to make sure that we're seeing eye to eye on this. That we're on the same team, you know? It's important to me. For a cop, nothing's more important than a good night's sleep. You can trust me on that. It seems I'm more like a nanny than a cop. And I'm all cop. Five forty in progress. Five forty complete. Five twenty two in progress. Five thirty four in progress.
522 complete. Five thirty four complete. Five nineteen in progress. Nineteen complete. Five twenty in progress. Five twenty complete. God, Lana, you know how to sneak up on somebody. You're seeing Plunkett today, right? Uh, 
Only if I manage to rake up all this paperwork before noon. Talking to the old man after that is useless. He'll already be soaking up his cocktails. I hear they're having problems with the new curator from the mayor's office, the one in the green jacket. I need to take notes on Isaac Brommel's testimony. You remember him, paralyzed at the waist. It's three hours one way. I'll be stuck there until evening. So I need you to give this folder to Plunkett. Mila says that he's leaving tomorrow, flying off on some conference, so I want him to get the folder today, okay? What do you have? I want the Jack Boyd case given special status. <laughs> oh, Lana, do you even understand what, what special status even means? I need access to the closed sections of the police department's archive. I need to be removed from all other cases. I need two assistants. I need support from Paulson. Lana. I need a surveillance team, a judicial order for Lana. the wiretapping of four witnesses. First of all, Emma Weinstein, and permission to Lana. search her. Lana, listen to yourself. What, what are you trying to achieve? Do you even understand what's waiting for you? It's one thing to drag all the witnesses through here ten times. Plunkett is somehow tolerating that. But it's another thing to... Oh, God. If you... Why don't you do something... Something easier? More relevant. Have you looked at the papers recently, Reeves? No one's seen Jack Boyd for almost a year, and he's still on the front pages. Show me something more relevant. Oh, Lana, look, God knows you did what you could. The asshole is already eight months on the federal wanted list. The feds can't find him. And you, I mean, can you? You mind-fucked all your colleagues, mind-fucked everybody, one by one, through the whole police department. Plus any poor son of a bitch who ever saw him, talked to him, delivered him pizza, or checked his prostate. You went through mountains of documents, some of which you were not supposed to see, and I have always been ready to look the other way. Until you come You're in- You're not my boss, Reeves. I don't care if you looked the other way. I never asked you for help with the investigation, and I'm still not. Just give Plunkett the fucking folder and make sure he's sober enough to read it. Five fifty in progress. Five fifty two in progress. Five twenty nine in progress. Five fifty two complete. Five twenty four in progress. Five twenty nine complete. Five twenty 
550 complete. Five fifty three in progress. Five eighteen in progress. Five thirty four in progress. Five twenty four complete. Five fifty three complete. Five forty two in progress. Five thirty two in progress. Five fifty two in progress. Five eighteen complete. Five thirty in progress. Five fifty four in progress. Five thirty two complete.
542 complete. Five fifty four complete. Warren Nash. It's me, Jack. I have a strange question for you. How would you say your work is going? What are you talking about? I mean, I don't mean in general, just today. The work you did today, are you pleased with what you did? What kind of question is that? I'm talking about... I need to sleep, Lily. Jack, I'm not trying to... <laughs> 